hi welcome and welcome back to another video tutorial so um i'll be showing you how to enable layers in coral draw yes layers in coral draw so it's not only in photoshop that there are layers so i'll be showing you how to enable that and um all what you need to know about it in coral draw it's very simple and very very easy to do so um without any further ado let's jump right in Right, so once you have your interface here then um, you head on to um, your bars to so we're heading to the menu bar so um, under the menu bar you head on to object so then you head on to the last option here so I have it selected already so let me uncheck it now all right so um, let's follow the same process again um, menu bar object then you select object so once I click it you notice this area that shows up here in the right hand side of my screen so this here is the layers panel yeah for coral draw yet it's really really amazing and um just as we have it on photoshop we also have it on coral draw just that not everyone um uses it here and um i will say it's not too convenient um for most coral draw users but um for the sake of this tutorial i'll be showing you i'll be walking you through on how to set it up just like i showed you and um all what is required so um this is the layers panel for coral draw so um, you follow the process i showed you on how to um, bring up this area here all right so um there's an option to rename your layer here there's an option to um, rename your layer you double click or you just right click then you have option to rename your la your layers so if you're someone who names or who names each of your layer that is a whole lot of work then um this is your option for it so you can do same for any of the layers here all right so you can explore more and um find more options as well all right so um there's an option to hide your layers all right so i hid everything all right so um let's select a certain layer here so this is what i selected i can decide to hide this yes and also i can decide to lock this so these are the options you have it's just like that of photoshop all right so um there are other options too as well so you can search for a certain layer there's a search option here to search for any layer so if you're someone who um, names all your layers so um it will be very easy for you to um locate um any layer of your choice right so let's um say you rename a layer here and um, you're trying to look for it so you can come to this area here then you search for it you can also drag layers from um any from its current position to another so let's take um for instance um this layer for instance all right so let's drag it to probably let's keep dragging it to inside this power clip so we can't find this right because we dragged it from its previous position into that so that is an option as well so let's undo that control set so it's back to its um normal position and also once you group a certain layer once you group a certain layer take for instance this this area here so this is a grouped layer so once you click on this drop down menu you see all the contents that are involved or that are inside the group of this layer so um there are about five of them so you can select um any of them see what's um involved there all right so you can hide and unhide so you click on the job diamond so i also grouped um some certain objects inside the layers that i grouped as well so um you can decide to hide any of these um layers as well and also um once an image or there's a power clip in um, my design i have a power clip in this design that i created so um once you click on the drop down menu so these are the content inside my power clip right all right so um these are all the content that are involved in my power clip so it grouped them automatically so um i click on this um sign here and um, these are all the content that are involved so i can decide to select it or hide any um content inside my power clip from my layers panel all right so i don't know if you notice the change inside so um let's take for instance all right so let's do this for example so this is the this is what i selected and um, it has highlighted it inside so i can move this to whatever area of my choice and also there's an option to show object property so to enable that you come to 
this settings icon here then you click on it then you um select show object property so um it shows you um what um the properties of what um the object you used in the, your design so um this is the polygon uh, this is the tool i use the polygon tool and um this is the few color so it's just showing you all the details of all the objects that are involved in this um design so guys um that is it basically on how to enable the layers panel in coral draw it's very simple and um really really awesome to use so if you're someone who fancies this and um would prefer to work with layers in coral draw um i would recommend this for you so um if you found this video helpful do want to hit on that subscribe button turn on the post notification bell to get notified whenever i upload new videos and don't forget to like share and drop a comment and let me know what you think about this video thank you for watching and i'll see you on the next video tutorial